Yo, what's happening guys? Welcome back to the Rev Room. Today, I'm going to be telling you all about how to connect your Ring devices to your Orbi mesh Wi-Fi system the right way. A lot of people I've known, and I've read a bunch on the Ring forums as well as the Netgear forums, that's a company that makes Orbi, a lot of people have been having trouble setting up their Ring devices. But a lot of people, they gravitate towards getting one of these. This is the Ring Chime Pro. Now, what's the point of this, right? When they also have a Ring Chime, which is basically what it is. It just chimes. It makes a sound when the doorbell rings. But the Chime Pro also acts as a Wi-Fi extender. When you buy a full mesh Wi-Fi system, usually it's about one router and two satellites. So plenty of coverage there. But here's the problem. You don't want to use one of these. Too much Wi-Fi signal going around. You create too much Wi-Fi traffic and you're not going to get as good of a signal strength. You can't use these with the mesh Wi-Fi system. I mean, look, you can, but you definitely want to strengthen your main router with its satellites that came with it, right? I mean, that's how I look at it. A lot of people think that they need the Ring Chime Pro to specifically make your Ring devices work exceptionally. Now, let's say if you want to put an Orbi satellite close to one of your ring devices on whichever side of your house it's on, don't think that now you're going to use this to better connect you to the satellite that's going to run back to the router. What I would recommend doing is getting rid of these and buying yourself another satellite. Because I'll tell you something, I got about four of these, five of these maybe, and even when I did have these connected, I noticed I was getting very weak Wi-Fi signal and it would happen on and off. What I would do is go out, get yourself one ring chime. You don't need three of them. You don't need four of them. This is just to produce sound. I was going to use this just for the chime portion, but the problem is you have to connect this up to Wi-Fi. Regardless, this is going to be a Wi-Fi extender. You basically don't want extra Wi-Fi signal coming through your mesh Wi-Fi system. Too much Wi-Fi traffic equals a bad signal. That's what I believe, and I'll tell you what, I even put it to the test. I unplugged all of my Ring Chime Pros, and I just connected everything up to Orbi, and I got a perfect signal. To even strengthen it, I got myself an extra Orbi satellite. So when it does come to connecting your Ring devices to any of your mesh Wi-Fi systems, you definitely want to use the original satellites. That way it can connect best back to your router, and you'll get the best signal strength that you can get. That's just a quick tip. I've been reading on the forums. A lot of people haven't solved it. They change a bunch of internal router settings. I'm saying you don't have to do that. I tested it out myself and it works perfect. All of these Ring Chime Pros, I will not be using anymore. I don't need them. Half the time when the doorbell rings, what does it do? It goes off on my phone anyway. So if your phone's not near you or you don't have AirPods in, then maybe you might need more than just one ring chime. As you can see, the size difference, this is the regular ring chime. This is the ring chime pro. Also, I noticed too, the ring chime is not grounded. The chime pro is. Both have a reset button. I've been having a run-in with ring and the Orbi for probably about the past year or two now. And I just couldn't figure it out. I'm like, I don't understand it. I even upgraded my cameras and it still was giving me the problem. So I'm like, okay, this definitely ain't a device issue anymore. What is going on? That's really all I have in this video today. I hope this helped. Drop a comment down below if you've been struggling with this or I finally found the solution for you guys. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe as always. Don't forget to check us out on Instagram, Facebook, and Rumble at The Rev Room, of course. And we got videos coming every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Thanks again, guys. I'll see you next time. Peace.